Welcome back to my YouTube channel. So I've just been up at my parents. Um, I stayed there last night, hence the big duffel bag <laughs> and the change in scenery. So basically I got up this morning and did a little bit of meditation. Mum and I went for a nice 5k walk, um, which was really nice to just get out and clear our head. And then dad and I cooked omelets for breakfast, which you would have already seen. So yeah, um, I'm about to head home now and then I'll see you guys there for a little bit of a cooking episode. So see you soon. And we're back home now. So I wanted to bring you guys into the kitchen and do a little bit of a baking session. So I'm not sure if you remember, I think it was two videos ago now, I showed you my healthy granola recipe. And truth be told, I only ate that granola once, how you're like meant to eat it with like the milk and the fruit in it, um, which was the like time that I filmed it for you guys. And the rest of it, I just snacked on it because it was like so good on its own. So I literally went through four large containers of it just snacking between meals. Um, and it was like a little bit annoying to eat because like, it's small and crumbly like granola should be because you're not meant to eat it the way I was eating it. So I thought today we'd turn it into like a muesli slice instead. Um, and look, I'm a little bit nervous about this recipe just because normally I like trial it and make adjustments and then I'll film it for you when I know it's like 100% gonna taste delicious. But this one, I haven't tried it yet and we're purely just gonna wing it today. Get yourself a bowl and then we're gonna add in half a cup of coconut oil, half a cup of honey and half a cup of peanut butter. If your coconut oil is a little bit solid because you're in more of a colder climate, you can actually just take the lid off and microwave it for about 40 seconds, which will make it go all liquidy so you can actually just pour it out. So that's what I have done. I'm now going to put this bowl in the microwave probably for about 45 seconds, stir it 45 seconds again just to soften all of the ingredients and then while that's going you want to turn the oven on 160 degrees fan force. So because I already put the oil in the microwave before putting it in here and I only actually needed 45 seconds so this is like the mixture. Uh, it looks like this. There's like no way of me showing you without like getting it all over the floor. <laughs> so now you want to put that aside and get a bigger bowl. We're now going to add in a cup and a half of rolled oats and about a cup and a half of just mixed nuts. So I'm just going to quickly go in and break some of the nuts up that are like super, super big, um, just in half. So they're kind of like still chunky, but just not like a whole pecan in your mouth. About a third of a cup of almond flour and a third of a cup of coconut flakes. I'm then gonna add between a half and two thirds of a cup of coconut sugar in there. Some salt, cinnamon, and then half a teaspoon of baking soda. And then the remainder of my dried fruit. So, I'm gonna add in some mulberries, dried blueberries and strawberries, some dried banana, just gonna cut those up into little pieces, some dried pear, once again just gonna cut it up into smaller pieces. Come here! Come say hi! No, thank you. And some pumpkin seeds. Now you're gonna get your little mixture again. If this is, like give it a little stir, but if it's gone solid, just chuck it back in the microwave for about 40 seconds again, but mine seems to be okay. And we're just gonna pour it on top. So give it a really good mix through now. It actually probably would have been a really smart idea to mix the dried fruit before the wet stuff, so definitely do that. Perfect. So this is the consistency you want. Mm. 
So this is what your slice should look like. I've just gone in and cut off any remaining baking paper just so it doesn't burn. And we're gonna chuck it in the oven for 25 to 30 minutes. So while that's baking away, I'm thinking we might actually go and do a little bit of an ab circuit just because I know I went for that walk with my mum this morning, um, which was really nice and like a little bit more relaxing. But I think my coffee that I was drinking while I was making that has just kicked in and I've got a bit of energy. And I don't know, I just feel like training abs today. So that's what we're gonna go do. Um, something that I really need to do tonight after I get off here with you guys is do some research into different planter boxes. So if you've been following my channel for a while, you know that we are doing a backyard reno that's kind of been put on pause since I went back to work. And so this is what it's currently looking like. So it's still fenced off from the dogs um, just because obviously we need to finish it first. Um, all the pavers are down. We need to go in and clean all the little white stuff off, but that's all happy and done. In here, we want to get two gray planter boxes that are like, oh, kind of like a whitewash gray. And then in the middle, like a little wooden seat. And then there'll be tropical palms coming out of the two planter boxes. But yeah, I just, I really want to get it done. Um, purely for the fact that like then it'll be done. I can utilize the space. I can do my morning meditation out there. We can take the fence down so the dogs have more room as well. Even though they only just sleep over there. You can't see them. <laughs> Where are they? There's one and there's two. Yes, I need to clean my windows. It's on the to-do list. <laughs> so yeah, I'm just excited for the space to be finished and done. And then I'll actually be able to do workouts out there outside um, and film them for you instead of like filming upstairs in like, it's kind of a weird walkway that I'm filming in upstairs behind like, it's like a movie theater that backs onto a hallway and that's where I am. Um, but yeah, I just really want to get this space done. So I really need to organize the plant boxes for that so we can start getting a move on. Anyway, um, I'm going to go get changed back into the clothes I was wearing this morning um, so that I can meet you upstairs and do a little ab circuit. So I'll see you then. And that is going to conclude today's video. I hope you guys did enjoy and get some value out of it as always. And if you did like this video, I'd really, really appreciate if you could quickly pause and give it a like and subscribe because it really does support my channel and I really do appreciate it. Also, feel free to leave a comment below if there's any types of videos or certain topics you'd like me to talk about because I'm always looking for new ideas and new ways to help you guys out. But besides that, I hope you're having a beautiful morning or night. Whenever you're watching this, I look forward to seeing you next Sunday at 11am. Bye guys!